Hello, welcome to another video. Today we're gonna be doing an unboxing. This unboxing is from One Day Saving. They did send me these items to review, so thank you to One Day Savings. So, move the stuff to the side. So I did get more pens. So these pens are $2.47 on the website. All right, so I got this one that has like little beads inside here and this one here that has this I'm wondering if I have to clean it a little bit. It seems a little dusty. It has this like geom like this swirly shape in there. Um I actually personally really like these pens. I have ones that I was using that has like wheat in it. Um it I was like, let me find the one with wheat. Um, I have one that's very similar that has the wheat in it, and it's actually one of my favorite diamond painting pens. The only thing is, I have broken them before using the metal, the metal multi-placing tips. But yeah, it's one of my favorite ones. I think it's one of those ones that it's just the right width for my hand, and it's relatively light. So I was like, when I saw this, I was like, ooh, look, this one has beads inside and I don't know this one has a swirly thing inside and like I said it's 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 the right size for me they're just like I said the metal multi-placers I've broken I think two of them from metal the metal multi-placers but they're relatively inexpensive so even if you break them with the metal multi-placers it's still it's still good and what's nice is I do like um you're gonna I, I have to probably shove that in a little harder um it's not going in maybe it's supposed to be on the the multi-placers go in relatively well i know i could get this in here because i have it in the other one. Oh, i broke it <sighs> okay but that's okay i like this tip <laughs> I was gonna say that I like th I like this tip here. It's a little bit different than the normal diamond painting tip. If I could find an example. Like I have so much things next to me and I can't find a regular bolt pen. Well, here, see, it's 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 a little bit longer than this other tip and it's I think this is like the stainless steel tip. But yeah, like I said, the I have broken <laughs> multi-placers. I've broken the pen from multi-placers. But yeah, here is this one and here is this one. Um, I It also comes in um, other colors like pink, purple, red, and things like that. And A while back, I got this one with wheat. I really like this one with wheat. I feel like the one with wheat is a little bit lighter. So. But like, yeah, let me say. I, I, I really do like these pens. But like I said, <laughs> they're not the most durable, but they're cheap enough that they could be semi-disposable pens, right? Every all pens are kind of disposable, right? They run out of ink. All right, let me put that away there. All right, next thing. Next thing. What am I? We'll do this one since I took the um the pen from it. So ordinary toolkit, except there is a couple baggies. This the bag did break on its way to me. So at first I was like, oh no, something. So this is some coasters. So they're actually plastic. This, you know, I do have this Mod Podge. I've been meaning to try it. This Mod Podge dishwasher safe. And this might actually be a good one to test it out. Um, because do I want to test out putting one of these in the dishwasher? You won't see it in this video. 
because it does take like a month, I think, to dry, but it would be a good thing to test this out. So it does come with this, which is supposed to be the holder, I believe. The holder shouldn't be that hard to put together, right? Well, that will be for the end of the video. When everything is done. But this should be the holder for the coasters. So this is the coaster holder. Somehow I think it goes like that. How does the picture look? And I'm guessing you're going to just put the coasters in this way. So here is the coasters. There should be eight of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight coasters and they're mandalas. So here is one. Here, it looks like all the symbols are numbers. Here's one mandala here. Here's another one. You know, I think I have this in a diamond painting form. I just don't, this mandala in a diamond painting form. Although I don't think I've finished it yet. <laughs> Story of the life of folks with stashes. Here's the other mandala. This actually might take a while. There's actually a good amount of drills in here. Here's another one. This one. And not all of them are round, so they do, some of these are more shaped. Oh, I like this one. Well, I don't know. You can't tell with these until it's diamond painted how it's going to actually look. So I got some mandala coasters. So these mandala coasters are $12.97 on the website. And I'm going to just measure one of the round ones because I figured that's easier. It's about 10 centimeters with um, diameter. And, okay, there's a good amount of drills in this one. So there might be 20 colors. So some clear, red, pink, yellow, green, blue, brown. Here's some black. I think those are just regular drills regular black drill, some purple, pink, more green, and so they're all regular size drills. No specials in this one. No special size drills. If you consider these crystal rhinestone specials, then these are specials. Oh no, it's not going to fit in the bag. How was it done every two? Mandalas. This is this. I'm actually thinking this will take a while. Committing myself to doing long, long things. All right, diamond painting. This one is a thirty by thirty. If I could find the opening there. And. This is $4.59 on the website. So, ordinary toolkit. These are round drills. And here it is. It's some ice skates. You know, I really liked watching figure skating when I was younger, and the one time I tried um, ice skating, I was terrified, so I was like, yeah, it's much harder than you think. <laughs> so I don't know how to, I don't know how to ice skate. So this thing has 20 colors. There, the symbols are one, two, three, and it looks like it's actually letters, also in alphabetical order, just not all of them. So this looks like, okay, it, the legend here, I mean, the the print does have guide circles. See, the guide circles around the Y here. So, not the biggest fan of the guide circles, but as long as you place the drills well enough, it shouldn't be that noticeable. 
this actually has a good amount of confetti here. So ice skates here. This is 25 by 24 and a half. And let's look at the drills. Did I say this was $4.59? If I didn't, I just said it now. So some white, blue, green, a dark blue it looks like. Some more green. Blue, reds, lots of blues. This one has a good amount of blue since it does look like it's a darker picture. Some purples. Oh, there's a good amount of purple. Oh, I think the skates are actually purple. That's what these are. There. I usually have my chair next to me and then I plunk them onto my chair. So next item is a storage box. For whatever reason, I thought these were going to be like the size for my cube storage, but it's actually much smaller. But I, it's because I don't bother reading and do I read, do I read the descriptions? No. So it's this butterfly here. These two butterflies. Okay, so the stuff must be in here. So it does come with an ordinary toolkit, except it does have some black tweezers. And... No, I was thinking that sometimes these come with the, the, the thing to put on the bottom, but it does not have it. So it's there. So this is only... Where is my... This is a 17 by 18. So it's probably more like an 18 by 18. And looks like it just has a few colors here. So all the symbols look like they're numbers. So here's some big black ones, some blue teardrops, some purple teardrops, I think that's a really pretty purple teardrop, and then some black drills, so purple drills, blue and green and pink. So this one should be really quick to do. And this one is $8.99. Let's put this in there so I don't lose the drills. And last item. It's in this box. Okay, this one is $12.23. If I could find where I'm opening it. And it should be a wreath. Oh, it's a lit up wreath. So it does come with some lights here. Comes with a chain and there are two holes over here to hold the chain. Or no wait, those are maybe those are just holes to hold the light fixture. So the light um there's foam here I'm guessing to um to put the light onto somewhere like here and then there's a couple holes here 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 and in there and there i'm guessing to put the lights around it so it does come with an ordinary toolkit with some baggies and it does come with the hanging there so it's this wreath here. It does look like it has a snowman and a snow woman with some oranges uh, oranges and and some cookies and some bells and that's a cookie I think and then I don't know if this is a poinsettia but it doesn't look exactly like a poinsettia but I'm guessing that's what it's going to for and the symbols look like all 
numbers here. So this is about 29. Yeah, 20, 29. 29 in diameter. And did I say this is 1223? I probably did. I was like, oh, look at the cute little snowman, snow couple, I guess. So some big red dome drills here, or the really big ones. I'm guessing those are that one. Or no, is it that one? This one is the smaller ones. So some big domed red ones, some smaller ones, and then a gold drill. One, there's one gold drill. I'm guessing it's right that one. Yeah, 23. And then... So there's like 23 colors in this thing, so some clear red, pink, there's no symbol, there's no crystal code or anything, some green, a good amount of green here, and these look like some bigger black drills, alright, let's put this back so And just put this in here so I know it's the wreath. Alright, so that's the last one I'm unboxing for this video. Let me move you a little bit up so we can see everything here. Uh, so there is the wreath. Here's the butterflies. Here is the skates. And the various mandalas. Lots and lots of mandalas. So I am going to work on some stuff here. I think I'm going to probably do the butterflies and the mandalas. If I get to the wreath, that will be a bonus. <laughs> because yeah, this is actually a good amount of stuff. So that's all I have for now. So I'll see you later. All right, I'm back. And the butterfly box is done here. It's cute. It's it's a nice simple project. Let's see. This is an 18 by 18 centimeter box here. There was eight colors. One was regular round drill, four were crystal rhinestones, and three specials. I thought the rendering was okay. There are guide circles, so you can see them underneath. There was a lot of excess um, glue, and well, I don't know about a lot, but I wrote some. The can it's a box, the drills were normal, this took me 27 minutes to complete here. So, so yeah, I think it's it's nicely rendered here. Butterflies are usually relatively turn out really nice as diamond paintings here. So yeah, there's that one done. Okay. And I also finished the wreath here. I think when this one turned out really nice. I like it. Did I write anything? Let's see. It's about a 29 centimeter diameter with 23 colors. 19 were crystal rhinestones and four specials. I thought the rendering was fine. Everything was fine. Uh, let's see. This took me two hours and 55 minutes to complete. I added drills to the eyes. Oh, here. I added drills to the eyes of the snow snow couple here it originally just didn't have any drills and there was the exact amount of this big red drill here and then this gold drill here i always put that in there because you know sometimes you're i i like as long as you have enough it's fine but sometimes you want that extra and that's all i wrote so i think this turned out really nice, I think. Like the flowers, I think it has like a good definition in them. They're with the slightly different color combination and then the oranges too here. The cookies, I'm not sure so much about the the drills on it. It's just kind of random, almost random. Well, this one is a little bit nicer, this cookie here. But this one, I was like, it just has some white drills here. And yeah, no, I think it looks, I think it looks really, really nice. This did come with this light here, and there is extra holes um, around. See, there's a hole here, 
there's another hole there, a hole here, a hole there. Well, I think this is supposed to do the chain, but I don't plan to use the light here. And there's some foam things. I think it's supposed to go with the light so that you can mount the light to the back of the wreath. So you can add the light, which I'm not going to, but I will add this chain here. If I could figure out exactly where is the best, I don't know if it's going to fit. Because it's all the way back there. Yeah, and then see, that one's all the way back there. Let's see. I didn't try out the chain before the video. Okay, it does fit. Okay. I just think it's like really far back. And this one has a drill in front of it. Okay. Oh, I knocked off the drill. Which might be a good thing anyway. Because I don't know if the drill would have survived the where the chain is. All right. I did seal this, but I only sealed it like minimally because I figure you're not going to be like doing this there. So there is that one done. All right. Yeah, no, I think this one turned out nice. I really like it. I know what's coming up during, what's going to be put up during the Christmas time. Okay, and I finish the coasters. Let me tell you, the coasters took a little bit of time. So the coasters were about a 10 centimeter diameter with 20 colors. They are all crystal rhinestones. I thought the renderings were great. I, well, I wrote good, the symbols were fine, everything was fine. This took me three hours and 18 minutes to complete. And I really do like some of these ones. So here is this one here. I think this one turned out really nice. I kind of really, I really enjoyed doing these uh, coasters. Like I just kind of felt like I was doing um, mandalas, several many mandalas, and I liked how full drill they were. This one's really pretty too. Here's this one. I think that one's, I really like this one the flower and then i really like this color here this this color drill that they put they chose here i think that one turned out really nice here i actually think i have this as a diamond painting this mandala but this one turned out really nice too and this one is a really pretty pink one here and there is this one here And this one. I think my favorite is this one, either that one or I, I kind of I kind of like I kind of like these ones that are not round. All yeah. So I did highly enjoy this this set here. So this did come with a holder, which I have not put together, and I have not attempted to put together yet. I figure I should get my chair so that I'm closer down to the table. And let's put together the holder here. Is there a side that's better? Okay, the print is on outside on this side, so. Or do you want the print to be inside? That is the question. Ooh, does this thing have extra plastic? Sometimes folks told me, Joan, you need to take off the extra plastic. I don't think there's an extra plastic. If there is, I tried. Okay. 
here. Why doesn't it want to go in? Am I incompetent? I could also be incompetent. Maybe there's an extra plastic on this thing. Nope. Okay, there. And screws. Okay, let's hope that I can get these to fit in here considering how much it did not want to go in the other way. So. I do like that these came with a holder. Okay, let's screw this side in. I have like so many of these little screwdrivers now. So, let's see. All right, it does, it fits. could probably fit probably four more in here so there is the coasters so let me spread these out again for the end of the video here so there's the coasters done the wreath here and the butterfly butterflies the butterfly box there well, let's move this here so you can put the butterfly box there all right so that's all the finishes i did for this video so thank you to one day saving for sending these items for review and thank you for watching and happy diamond painting bye